Hi there! I'm Woodhouse204, and you're watching episode 9 of our Suikoden replay. Uh, I'm joined, as uh, as usual, by my good friend Austin. Hi, Austin. How are you? Hello, hello. I'm doing great. Uh, good. Got back, from a, got back from a little vacation, and uh, I'm, I'm ready to uh, beat up Fonda Rossman. That's right. Yeah, I saw the pictures of that. It looked really nice. Oh, uh, yes. I... Uh, we went to Washington State, which is up in the top... Uh, top... Uh, West. Top yeah, thank West. You. I know directions. Thank you for telling uh, me that, because like I, I was like, when you when you said I went to Washington, and I was just thinking, well, this doesn't look like the West Wing. Like, where, yeah. where's all the the you know the old buildings? Where, where's all that? You know. So, thank you for explaining that to me. I'm I'm not the the best when it comes to American like geography. So. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's that's perfectly okay. There are plenty of people here in the states who aren't good at American geography. Really. Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, but yeah, uh, Washington's up in the up in the top, tippy top northwest, uh, and it is just this beautiful, lush, verdant forest that goes on forever. Wow! Yeah, I mean, it definitely looked like it. Some of the the pictures you put up were great. Like, uh... oh yes. So we've got the, the treasure. Uh, so before we started, uh, Austin and I went through a little bit of. Um... A, oh, we got that too, so... Let me... So, uh, let's see... Do, 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 uh, northeast... Uh, then go northeast for the old book, Volume 1. Do we have that? I think we do, you know. Um, okay. I think that... Oh, these are new. I don't think we've seen the Devil Shields before. But yeah, um, so a couple of things we should probably clear up. Uh, we haven't been on for a little while. Um, yeah. One one of the reasons for that is because you went away, uh, and the other reason the is other because reason. Uh, I got COVID. I, I got uh, I was I was sick. I was ill. Um, you you may notice me coughing a little bit tonight. Uh, I apologize. I'm trying not to. Um, but uh, yeah, I, I was out out of action for a little while. And it, it's been really nice not being going to work. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> it's been it's been so nice. People have been leaving me alone. Like, it's yeah. yeah. I, I've I've had some time, and uh, I've so did. I'm fully vaccinated. Uh, it just acted like a, a a big cold. I'm guessing that's where the, the book was. Could be. Uh, let me see. Oh, so from here, uh, are we going upstairs again? It looks like. It says go down, get the half armor and gauntlet. I don't know where those are. Let, let's. Well, it's not going to be there, so I'm going to guess it's here. Uh, did we get the Gale Crystal? I tell you what, let's. Oh, who's let, this? Oh, okay. Is she a devil armor? She didn't look like a devil armor. <laughs> okay. I'm guessing we started the fight before we could actually talk to her. Um, oh, oh, this okay. is the guy that this is the guy that fires out all the bits of armor at you, isn't he? Oh, Do you he remember that? Be. Yeah. Oh, he didn't even get an attack. That's good. But yeah, um, I'm fully vaccinated. Like I'm just, it was just like a bad cold, really. Shall we rest? There I think we, we shall. So didn't this, didn't the guy say something about resting? Yes. So from here we go up. Okay. And ooh, maybe not. Hold on. Maybe I'm crazy. <laughs> yeah, it says rest, go up, and then go east, and then get the Gale Crystal. East? Which is interesting because east does not appear to be an option. It's not. Uh, okay. Well, let's, let's look around a little bit and. Uh, does it say anything about going upstairs? I think it did earlier. But it, it says that eventually our goal is to make it to a, a large courtyard. A large courtyard? Okay. Which looks like the room directly to the south of us. Yeah, I'm thinking... Unless I'm crazy. Yeah, I... I've been playing... Um, I, I've been doing a lot of what you were doing before, by the way. I've been playing a lot of uh, Alex Harmon's new mod. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm I'm liking it. It's it's a lot more, should we say, uh, subdued. So it, I should probably explain. Uh, 
A friend of ours, uh, Alex Harmon, uh, also known as Dark Claw, makes uh, mods for uh, Shining Force 2, which is a, a strategy RPG game that's on the uh, that's on the Mega Drive. This looks like a yeah. boss room. Yeah, this does kind of look like a boss room. Uh, but we are headed towards a boss, so probably best just to make sure that we're... Hey, health looks okay. I mean, we just uh, rested, Valeria so... Valeria could use some. I, I'm just doing that. Yeah. Um, and, uh, <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, we got the old book there. Okay. Uh, okay, I think I think we should. That's that's a dragon. That's dude. Did you did you camera that fall? Is straight up a dragon. No, I, I I was trying to I was trying to fix it. Uh, I'm using a new camera. Uh, okay. It, it, it's on a uh, it's on a uh, what do you call it a tripod. And the tripod oh, yeah. seemed a little, uh, seemed a little, uh, ill-balanced, and so I was trying to fix it. You see that crit there for 400? I did. That was, that was a spicy crit. Yeah. So how is Austin, by the way? Austin's apart well. From, uh, apart from your, you know, your, your trip out. Yeah. Your trip across the uh, country. The trip out was great. It was, uh, it was a lot of fun. Got to, got to hang out with my mom, and, uh, she, she put us in mortal peril. Uh, which oh. was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was a lot of fun after everyone was okay. Uh, at the time, I was like, "Woo!" But uh, so they have a they have a big they have like two, some two hundred acres of land out there, and that's that's a bit of land. Okay, that's, that's a bit of land, and uh, like most of it is going up a up up a mountain, like, and so um, they have a jeep, and. Uh, so she wanted to show me around the property. Fair. So we we ended up driving up this this craggy mountain road, like a, any any stereotype you have ever seen of yep. like mountain on one side, single lane road that isn't that isn't even really a road, and then on the other side, like a precarious hundred foot fall to your death. Oh uh, god. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Anything you've seen like that is 100% what we were doing, and she would have to she would have to speed up because it got so steep at certain points. Uh, can, can, I, can I just ask why? So they uh, one, she just wanted to show me around, and and she wanted to, she wanted to show off. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> and, so uh, were you in genuine peril or just? It, it was just like, for it felt moment, like I was I felt, For a moment, it felt like I was, but my, my mom apparently was like, so So basically what had happened was we were, we were driving around the property. Ooh, uh oh Ooh, by Victor. Oh, oh never mind. That was are you a level for this guy? <laughs> yeah, I think we are. Because he's, like, he's doing damage, but he's nothing scary, really. Yeah, he's doing, like, regular enemy damage. Yeah. Sorry, please, please continue. But yeah. You yeah, and so, uh, like, she she does this drive all the time. So, okay. so even though it felt like we were in mortal peril, uh, we we probably weren't as in as much mortal peril as I was feeling in my heart. But <laughs> okay. at one point, at one point, uh, we we were driving down the trail, and we hit a point where a tree had fallen over, uh, literally over the over the thing, and so we couldn't get past. It. It was, the, the trees are just too big and too thick up there. Wow. Um, and uh, and so it had fallen over, and we were like, uh-oh. Uh, all right, we're going to have to back up. And so we have to back up. We have to back up uphill. Uh, yeah. And she had to make a three-point turn uh, in this, this situation where it's literally like, you know, cliff on one side, yeah. on the other. <laughs> And so she made the three-point turn, but uh, she was eventually like, "Hey, uh, hold on, get out of the car real quick. Uh, I I'm just going to do this, and then I'm going to drive up the hill, and, and you guys catch up. You guys catch up to me, uh, just in case." And I was like, "All right, well, just in case. I love you, mom." <laughs> <laughs> okay. All <laughs> right. Let it not be said. Yeah. Uh, when she was like, she she just laughed and was like, "Ah, oh, it'll be fine." And and it was. Uh, but yeah, it was it was pretty scary looking. Uh, at one point, I was like, Mom, Mom. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna assume by the way that this dragon is like weak to uh, arrows or something because there's been a couple of times where Kirkus has hit him for like 400. It looked kind of like he was weak to everything. Uh, well, yeah, you're not wrong. We still got a level up of him, which yeah. seems odd. I'll take it. Yeah, he's still get boss XP, I guess. Uh, Alrighty then. Yeah. Have you ever seen um, Top Gear? Yes, I've I've watched that a few times. Have you seen the episode where they went to South America? I don't believe so. Uh, so. There's, there's some footage of them going to South America where there's like, I think it's Peru or something like that, where everything's up in the mountains. Yeah. Uh, and they have to um, go along like more or less single track roads uh, where it's hundreds of feet drop on one yeah. side and they meet another car and they meet another vehicle and one of them meets a bus and they have to try and negotiate between this narrow path between them. <laughs> it's it, it's Ooh. It's... Yeah, the, the, the some I, drone. I, I think they got some drone shots of it. It's just like it made my stomach drop, and I, you know, I, yeah. I'm normally not like that, but it was, yeah, it was like, bad to look at. If I watch people, if I if I watch people who are like climbing up stuff that goes just really, really high up, yeah, I, I, just, I, I feel my hands get clammy, and I'm just like, because like like just the the. I, I guess the empathy or whatever. Just yeah, I, I I'm instantly putting myself in that position, and I just. Yeah, it's a bad deal. Yeah. Um, did we have a, a person playing uh, Wonder Rose? I Roseman? say you were voicing him, but I, I'm honestly not. Okay. Are you the leader of the Liberation Army? You look familiar. Teo's son. I've heard rumors, but... Teo's boy a rebel leader, eh? Don't expect me to pull my punches. They once called me Quanda the Insurmountable, and I shall once again become the wall that protects Emperor Barbarossa. So come, Liberators, see my strength. See the power of the black rune that Lady Windy has given me. Okay. So, boss fight? Oh, it's a one-on-one -on -one oh, fight. One one. I've forgotten these. For the Empire, and for His Majesty the Emperor. I won't let you proceed. Why were they so insistent that we had specific party members that they were just gonna run you on it? I don't know. Victory is near. I strike with all my might. Uh, oh. If he strikes with all his might... So it's a rock, paper, scissors situation. I'm gonna go so for a desperate guess... attack. Okay. I think that cancels them out. Although I have less energy than he does. Which. Okay, not anymore. Now you're not even. Interesting. How about another round? Okay, let me just um, uh, take, <laughs> take take my uh, uh, extra strength juice here. Uh, now I'm ready for another round. Um, I'm gonna defend him. Yeah. I think I think I counter him then. Yes. Nice. Okay. Damn! I underestimated you. So I guess attack. Beats desperate attack? I think attack beats defend. Oh, okay. Victory is mine. Easy. <laughs> yeah, easy. When when you get it when you get it right, yeah. You didn't even need it. <laughs> well done. That you should destroy my defenses. Impossible! It's Lady Windy's black rune! Which I didn't use in that one on one duel. <laughs> oh no. It's your favorite character again. Yeah. You mess everybody up. You fix them. Cobbled. Why are you still sane? The Black Rune. Ah, my arm! Ah! Oh. What's going on? He's got L RGB lights in his uniform? I'm not sure. Something to do with a black room, I think you said? I don't know. I don't know, I haven't been paying attention. I wasn't in that fight. Ah, I'm not... My throat is not in... Yeah, in yeah, no, fair. <laughs> I am not up for that today. Oh, I... 
Oh, well, I thought he was gonna have a monster form or something, but he's just ah. Wait, what? Oh, okay. What happened? <laughs> Prepare to die. Get him. <laughs> Time. Oh for Jesus. Revenge. Kirkus is in on this too. We're gonna, we're gonna, uh, what was it, Cleos? We're gonna Cleos him. Yeah. We're just gonna surround him, get him, and then he disappears. Elf, cobbled. I see. Do what you must. You have the right, I believe. Well, wait a minute. Something's wrong. Are you Commander McDole of the Liberation Army? Please go ahead and take my head. I'll die like a soldier. <laughs> well, you know what? Uh, this feels you know like what? <laughs> you know what? We, we've we've killed before. We have. We're, we're no stranger to to vengeance. We're gonna continue being vengeful. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Emperor Barbarossa, I'm sorry I could not protect you until the end. I enjoyed the ten years I fought with you. Farewell, Emperor. Prepare yourself. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> so this is the end of my war. Oh. Uh-oh. It's been a long time, McDull. Oh, did you defeat Quanda? I give him the black rune, yet he falls. What a useless fellow. Who are you? Fix everyone. A cobble? I see Quanda's black rune melted, and you've become free of your curse. McDull, don't think you can get away with your antics forever. My beloved Barbarossa will destroy you. Well, I must be on my way. See you, McDowell. Okay, bye. <laughs> I, yeah, I guess. I... <clears throat> Congratulations, Commander McDowell. Our first battle was a great success. And we did it on the first attempt. Mm -hmm. And no one can tell us otherwise. Poor old Mimi. <laughs> oh, mommy! Is poor Mimi a child? <laughs> I don't know. Poor old Mimi. Brother! I'm touching. I kind of want, it, want him to be like Liquid Snake there. Wait. <laughs> Brother! Brother! It looks like their spell is broken. Ah. Thank you, Master McDowell. What will you do now? The village is gone, and perhaps my war is not over yet. At least, not until your war is over, Master McDowell. Please. Let me join the Liberation Army. I've gotten a taste for killing Humies. Yes. Me too. <laughs> and me as well! <laughs> Not so vain, right? It could be dangerous. No, I'm staying with you forever, Kirkus. I'll join too. Mm. Gremio hates elves, it turns out. I feel like people are trying to steal my main character status. <laughs> Grummy me fight. Everybody fix. The country still sickness. I too have no place to return to. To prevent this tragedy from repeating itself, let me fight as well. Commander McDowell, this battle has made you a man. For killing you people. So many people are willing to join you. Now let's get back to Ca Grayskull Castle. Ah, so we could go back into the castle to get more things if need be. 
but we don't. Uh, know, so. yeah. We got everything, so. Oh, we're back here. Fantastic. Oh, excellent. Uh, blah, 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 blah. We need to rest, actually. I'm assuming... Oh, here we go. Oh, three months after defeating Quanda Roseman's army. Easy. Yeah. Oh, we're in a bigger oh. room now. Oh, look at that. Can we explore the... No. Okay. Don't forget me, Gremio, who stands outside of your room just waiting yeah. for you to go on an adventure. Oh, young master, what happened? That's it. This is where Gremio lives. Like, he doesn't have a room of his own. <laughs> where did you... Uh, I, I'll take the hallway outside of young master's room. Yeah, I guess. Where, where did the, all these extra rooms and stuff come from? Like, we just built them? I guess them? you're just building onto the, uh, the dangerous spire that you built your castle onto. Uh, yeah, same, some things never change. Yep. Some things never change. Like, bad translations. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I've, I've been playing some of uh, Alex's um, new uh, new mod, and um, mm -hmm. I, I like where it's going. Like, previously, some of his other mods have been uh, maybe slightly wacky. Um, they've, they've got some interesting elements to them. This one seems a little bit more professional, if I had to... Mm. to Say something I see, about yeah. Uh, I think I got to. <clears throat> I want to say I got to around north of the part where Northern Promethea starts, uh, and then I, I sort of fell off, and and you know my two week period uh, happened. Was up, yeah. So I I just got to the, I just did the last fight in the tower. Um, oh okay. Uh, before you leave for Parmesia, right at the beginning of the game. Oh, okay, okay. So I, I'm like, not that oh, far. Nice fight at the tower, alright. No, wow. no, no, no. Um, who's Flick? Am I Flick? I think you were Flick. Yeah, okay. Why isn't Odessa here? This is the new Liberation Army's headquarters, right? After our hideout was attacked, I managed to round up the scattered remnants of the army, and we finally found our way here to this mystery. What the hell's going on? Hey, you, you're my doll, right? Where's Odessa? my throat uh because uh your flick right hey who's this guy i'm matthew silverberg odessa's brother i'm now the liberation army's chief military strategist i'm going through some voice changes because my throat is knackered Odessa's brother. So where is she? She's here, isn't she? <laughs> She's dead. She's dead. She's dead. Matthew! <coughs> <coughs> I can't. Mm. Yeah, dude, she died. she died like an hour after you guys left. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when we told you guys. I, what do you mean? I heard she was missing. Commander McDowell, may I tell him? You already have! <laughs> you already did! You told him the important bit. This is going to be one of those things where like the game won't progress unless you... Maybe. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. It, it seems weird that we're even still holding to this. Yeah, when we told him... She's dead. Odessa was killed when the hideout at Lenin camp was attacked. What? Victor, what happened? You're protecting her! <sighs> Forgive me, Flick. Forgive me. Odessa was thinking of the future of the Liberation Army right until her last breath. I see. And I suppose McDowell took over the leadership. Correct. As a completely new member, we did see that we did see it fit to to promote him to. Promote yeah. Him. You must be kidding, Humphrey Sanchez. Are you gonna let him get away with this? How can this kid follow after Odessa? 
Who's Humphrey? Uh, he's, he's been pretty quiet so far. I'll take him <laughs> just to give you a break. <laughs> yeah, cheers. These are his first words, I think. We need a leader. Dole is doing well. Lick, please calm down. Didn't you come here for a reason? Change the subject. Yeah, for a reason. To be shared with Odessa, not you, McDowell. Humphrey, Sanchez, I'll be staying at the inn in Kaku. If you change your minds, come and join me. You guys don't want to be with these scum, do you? What do we do? I have no idea. Master McDowell, Flick is in I shock after right hearing... Right. Sorry, it's like a... It's like a... Gotta get the door right now thing. Okay, it's fine. He's not usually like that. <sighs> I must have a good long talk with Flick. After all, he was vice he was vice commander of the Liberation Army. You're right. We need all the help we can get. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's been and a while, so <laughs> it's been a while, so I'm like, oh, okay, you're just gonna zip into me. Uh, Flick and the survivors of the old Liberation Army, if we could get them to join us. I'm guessing something else must happen before we can... Because usually we talk to, to Matthew when it comes to recruiting, like, building our uh, our party. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. Welcome, welcome. Take a look at this. Isn't it wonderful? I'm still trying to... I'm just, I'm, I'm, he's still losing his mind about it. He's like, yeah, this is it. Yeah. Every single day. We do crap to work here. But I'm going to anyway. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Um... You know, this room right here is way too cramped. Entirely cramped is the is the feeling I get in this giant spacious room. Okay, that... Level 9 is as high as he goes. So, we'll get Victor and McDowell to level 9. Um, so this is the way it goes with the uh, with the, the blacksmiths. You, they just li literally just line up in here. There's yeah. just like six of them. Uh, so cramped. Oh, I hate it. Uh, if only I wasn't just standing next to Moss all day. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this guy's in here now. Hey, it's me, Rock. You have business in my vault? I... Yes. Thanks. Nope. I, mm, My yeah. big vault of nothing? I, mm, yeah. Look, I'm very protect. <laughs> Please, you're not gonna put un unappraised ornaments in my vault. I guess not. There, there's no guessing about it, pal. <laughs> That's <laughs> not going into the, my boxes. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know what that is. But all these, you know, mythical yep. pieces of runes and things, they're completely oh, yeah, fine. That yep. Well, that, that's, that's, uh, that is 100% good. <laughs> okay, Rock, thank you. Thank you for making that perfectly clear for me. Oh, it's these guys. I've forgotten about these guys. Yeah, I miss that easygoing bandit life. It's been too long since I've separated a child from their parents for all eternity. <sighs> oh yeah. Is hey, he you owe me money. <laughs> when do you plan on paying me what you owe? I think she says that for the entire game. I know. Well, so we got like I, we don't even have we don't even appear to have the option to pay her back. No. So okay, I guess we have to go to Kaku and talk to to Flick. Yep. I'm guessing that's what it was implying there. But yeah, we're um, talking about what we've been up to, like, uh, weirdly enough, I, I've i had a week, well, I've had 10 days off from work, and I've been working on a lot of my backlog, which has been mwah, fantastic. Yeah. yeah. Um, so there's lots of things I'd like to talk about. Uh, not sure how much of it will actually... I assume they would be in here. Maybe they're downstairs. Upstairs. Who's this guy? It's a guy we can gamble with. Ooh. Would you like to be Gaspar? Yeah. 
How about a game, boss? If you win, I'll join you. I feel confident about my chances. I didn't say what happens if you lose, which is probably nothing. <coughs> All right. Here Sorry, we go. excuse me. If you win 5,000 bits from me, I'll concede defeat. You want to know how to play? Oh, those? no. No, 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 no. We're not doing this again. No. Yeah. No. Well, no. Here's, here's every rule. Did you get that? Do you want the instructions one more time? Yes. Ah! <laughs> how much? Classic Zelda owl trick. No. Um... 5,000. Let's just go yeah. for broke. Yes. My turn. Okay. Wait, what? It's a storm, so you pay triple. What? Play I again? feel like I, I feel like I didn't get anything good out of that. Yeah, sure, okay. I want my money back. Is this okay? Oh, my turn. Dude, you, oh. you messed up. You messed up. The dice are out of bounds. Do I get? Yay! I, I think I think we got most of our money back, and we got. And yeah, I think we got five thousand out of them. So. Too bad. I guess the god of dice doesn't think much of you yet. You Wait, didn't what? win a net five thousand bits off of me. Oh, I, I guess we got like four thousand. Yeah. <laughs> blah 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 blah. We need to win like one hundred more bits off him. No. Okay. I, uh, yeah, yeah. Do do a do a smaller amount first, just to make sure he's not cheating. Okay. Cool. Play again. It's always his turn, though. My hand is four. Oh, now I get to have a go. Okay. Oh, okay. That, Oof. That's less than four. One. I win. This is garbage, man. I'm not having this. Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is garbage. This, this is a bad game. game. Oh, it's a storm. You is it a storm? It. Doesn't look like a storm to me. Oh, okay. Doesn't, it doesn't look like a storm to me. I just need. Looks like we're about which... to fight Honda Rossman again. <laughs> <laughs> I need to remember which which save it was. Uh, I think it's uh, it's this one. There we go. I, I feel like my uh, my luck is going to go the other way this time. Maybe. No, I did this it again! Is a you throw dice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't need to hit him again. Okay, let's play. 2000. If you get Storm again, like, we'll know it's set. Nope. Looks like you're just unlucky. Right. Let's, this game let's... really does not favor the dealer. It doesn't favor anyone. It's a bad game. There you go. Right. All right. You're a lucky one. A lucky man can do anything. I'll throw in my chips with you. There we go. We we mysteriously won on our first try. First try. First try. But yeah, like my my backlog is long and large, like other things in my life. Um, I wonder if they're in here. I agree with Flick. I'll never accept you as our leader. Oh, screw you. Who's asking you? You're just a Until doorman. Do. Flick is inside. He's in shock. Oh yeah, McDowell, Victor. I was expecting you. Sorry, Flick. Because I was careless. I guess so. It's not your fault, is it? 
Odessa used to say to me, you should be more aware of your position as a leader. Those words are coming back to haunt me. Maybe she knew that her death was imminent, but I was unworthy of her expectations. Sick. I was so enraged at her death that I completely forgot what I came here for. No wonder she gave up on me. Okay. McDowell, I can't accept you as a leader yet, but this is no time for bickering. So I have a request. Will you join forces with me? Only if I'm leader. <laughs> <laughs> That's how that works. Good. I'm grateful. Now we can save our comrades. Well then, I'll assemble my men and take them to the castle in the lake. I'll never join him. Oh, oh, we're joining him? Oh, okay. Alright. <laughs> we're dull. We should be getting back to the castle, too. Wait, did... He just threw a hissy fit. Yeah. He came out here, and we now we're taking him back. We entire scene at the castle. <laughs> okay. Unless yeah, one... the castle is, like, on fire, and we needed to be away from the castle in order for that to happen, the, that entire scene could have... Oh, okay, here we go. It is it the same? I want to say it looks a little different, but I'm not sure. I'm not either. We'll have to check the tapes. Yeah. Um. Yeah, so... Of the many games that I've been playing, uh, the Banner Saga is, oh, yeah. is is one that I've been I've been looking at for the first time. I, I played that game. Uh, I love it. I want to. I, I have two and three, so they're a trilogy, and I have two or three. Oh, okay. uh, I'd really like to like record like my first time uh, playing them and uh, get somebody else's like first time playing them too. On tape, yeah, I've never. It... I, I I I think I played a demo of the first one at one point, like a while back. But uh, I, I I didn't get super into it. But yeah. uh, I I'm, I've heard good things. Oh, the the ch the the choices that you have to make in that game are just like <laughs> gut wrenching. They really are. It's oh, like it it stuff like that. it hurts so good, as I put it on on our Discord. Because um, mm -hmm. man, some of the choices the so I completed the the first game. Um, but a, a terrible cost. Nope. So uh, yeah, that it's it's definitely <laughs> one I want to want to check out. So um, yeah, I'm I'm definitely going to do that at some point when we get a chance. Yeah. Is everyone here? Then listen to me. After the hideout at Lonen Camp was attacked, I escaped toward Mil Milich's domain in the west. The west. Remember that. Millich? You mean Millich Oppenheimer, one of the five great Imperial generals? Right. I was out there rounding up the former soldiers of the Liberation Army, who were scattered all over the place. Suddenly, there was a crackdown on the rebel factions, and many of our comrades were captured. That was when I heard about a revived Liberation Army and came here. We must unite our forces and liberate Millich's domain. I agree. Combined with the men that Flick has brought, our forces should be strong enough to break through the entrance. To the west, the fortress of Garin. Commander McDowell, what do you think? Nah. <laughs> yes, sir, right away. <coughs> oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, we, we just got get right into it. Nice. Oh, okay. I love that. Thank oh, you. Oh, wow. Um, I was not prepared for that. Uh-oh. Liberation <laughs> Army? What's that? What? The guys who beat Kwanda's army? Here we go, young master. Please, take care. Oh. I'm here too. Yeah, let's go, Pan. I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, let's go. Okay, so first things first, we save the game because mm -hmm. you know this game is a bit wacky. Uh, 
First things first, give ourselves a nice lead. He, we did it. Obtained money. I don't want money. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we're charging our boost, uh, boosting our attack power. Here's the plan to make sure you obey it. Charge attack, power up. Watch them cast magic Yay. now and completely overpower us. <laughs> oh no, we actually that. Yeah. yeah. That's gonna absolutely wreck them. Okay. Looks good. Um, I think we use magic this time. Yeah. Wind room, show your power. Yes. That's the counter. Excellent. I think we win. <laughs> Yay! That, that was much easier than the first one. <laughs> we did it! We beat the Imperial Army! <laughs> Why have I not been able to win before? Do I suck? I guess I'm joining you now. How's that? <laughs> The Imperial Army acts big, but they're nothing. Whew. Oh, young master. Are you alright? Master McDoll, let's attack immediately and finish them off. Wait, Commander McDoll. We shouldn't attack without understanding what the enemy is thinking. Let's send a reconnaissance team to find out what they're up to. This feels like one of Alex's mods. Yeah. So, so I sent I sent him a picture today uh, of um, so there's there's a character that you recruit early on one of the se secret characters uh, Kiwi. Mm. Oh, uh, yes. And uh, the sentence uh, was, he, hmm, he looks. Uh, what was it? Let me let me let me have a quick. I had a, I had a, I had a chat with him about that. <laughs> Uh, when, when I saw the when I saw what the character was replaced with, or when I saw what Kiwi was replaced with, I was yeah. like, "Man, uh, he's like like Bowie walks in and and uh, Bowie walks in with the new character. He's like, hey guys, check it out! Look at what I got as a pet!'" And Yaha's like, "Dude, this is messed up." Yeah, <laughs> it's a dude. It's just like, it's, like, it's just a dwarf, man. Yeah, he is look strong. He is yeah, look strong. Yeah. And I think he did that on purpose because the guy's supposed to be like a sub, like a like a like a monster. Yeah. And so, uh, but yeah, yeah. I was like, I, I was like, man, poor poor Yaha. Yeah. Well, I'll get a screenshot of that conversation later. Uh oh. Wrong. The enemy is careless right now. It's our chance to attack. Follow me, everyone. Uh oh. He's not listening to Matthew. Uh-oh. Wow. All right, we're just right into it. Oh, I feel like this isn't going to go well, is it? Hopefully I... they'll at least recharge our army. Okay. Ooh. Oh, wow. I love this dude. Go ahead. What fools. I, I didn't sure press anything. How wonderful my Antoinette is. Please be careful. There's something wrong. I like the giant flower that is bursting from the Taj Mahal back there. Yeah, me too. That's that's an interesting touch. Uh, I feel like we're gonna get absolutely like rammed here. So. Oh yeah. It, this feels oh, like, like you're are going there to any lose. That, the increased defense. I don't know, but please don't have money. Oh my God, <laughs> Kryn! Just claim him out. <laughs> All right. Um. This always works well. This never goes badly. Yeah. Here, I'm back. Sorry. <clears throat> I think that person is back. Okay. Uh oh. What 
Well, that went well. I'll be right back too. I'm gonna go get a drink. Hello, hello. Alrighty. Yeah, no, uh, what's my food? Uh, your mic went off. Yeah, I was typing the the key that I have set to the thing in the in the chat. Anyway, uh, yeah, no, it wasn't even my pizza. It was a uh, guy trying to sell a a, a, a door store panel. salesman. Sorry about that. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Ow! I just bit my lip. Don't Ouch. do that. Don't do that. Yeah, so I don't think you saw, but some I weird saw the roses. I the thing right, yeah. before, right as I was running out. Uh, and we, we lost pretty much everybody, so... Oh, cool. So we had to retreat. It looks like it looks like that was that was a... Uh, it was supposed one to happen. One that you, you were supposed to lose, yeah. yeah. What kind of roses are those? We can't even get near the enemy. Ugh, we are in trouble. Perhaps we should send a reconnaissance team, after all. Okay, I'm coming along. Uh, McDowell? I'll go too. I haven't accepted you as a commander yet, even though I just bungled that and cost the lives of 5,000 men. I'll come along and see what kind of leader you are. The kind of guy who doesn't lead 5,000 people to their deaths <laughs> on a whim. Young master, you know that I'm going too, of course. Because I'm the main character. You can't have a game without Grimio. That's true. Uh-oh! Grimio! Easy there, pal. You stay. What, what are you saying, Victor? Who's going to protect the young master if, if I don't? Literally anyone else, Gremio. You're not that good at fighting. Don't you understand, Gremio? McDowell's no longer a child. He's the proud leader of the Liberation Army. Not a kid who needs your protection. Yeah, I mean, he's murdered plenty of people already. Yeah. But, but, but that's the reason why I shouldn't come along. Ugh. After leaving my village behind, I traveled all over the place. Oh goodyest, Victor's gonna tell us a story. Met all kinds of people, and experienced many things. That's why I sometimes have hunches. <laughs> okay, Victor. Romeo, stay here. You must be joking. Young master, you don't plan on leaving me behind, do you? Me? Grimio? Okay, space period. <laughs> <laughs> Stay here, Grimio. Young master, you too? Such a bad joke. Wait. Stay here, Grimio. Do it one more time. I swore to Master Teo that I would protect you through thick and thin. Please, young master, take me with you. I swear on my life to protect you. Again. Please, young master, take me too. Romeo, you're bound to get in the way. Give it up. Oh my god. Right, last yeah. time. No! You do such a bad joke. That's oh right. God. I trapped you in a dialogue trap. You thought you got a choice, but no. I, Gremio, am taking that away from you. Why Why would they do that? Why would they have like three lines of dialogue for that particular thing? To, to make you feel real bad for him. Yeah. Thank you, young master. I knew you would see reason when I forced you to see it. Shut up, Gremio. Dull. Kindness alone does not make a leader. Dude, I'm gonna I chastise to you man. over the choice that you didn't get to make. Thanks a lot, I guess. 
yes. Oh yeah, I brought everyone with us. Who do you want? So we got two uh, people. That... So we've tried all of these guys so far. I don't think we tried Eileen. No, we ha we have not tried Eileen. We should take we... Eileen, somebody who is proven. Like uh, Lapont's pretty good. Um, what about Stallion? We haven't tried Stallion yet. No, we haven't. So yeah, Eileen, Stallion. Oh, oh, okay. Party's full. Cool. I I feel like yeah, you know, everyone else Victor we have and... with us can carry the can carry the weight. Hmm. I'm kind of hoping we find like a blacksmith or something, just so we can, you know, level yeah, up everybody's we weapons. Soon. Yeah. Oh, a town. Mad Ivy. Uh oh. Oh, Flick has a, has a rune. Ooh. Brainstorm. Raging yeah. blue. Angry blue. Oh, that's right. He, I think he has um, water as his rune. Oh, okay. Yeah. Eileen has a rune as well. Which I'm oh, guessing yeah, she is has Earth. that earth one. Yeah. Uh, and Stalin does not. He's just an archer. And I just shoot arrows. With a giant nose. Have you seen the size of his nose? Yeah. He's, he's very aerodynamic. That's right. Wait, what? Wow, that was a lot of, uh, that was a lot of XP he got. Yeah, what was... Uh, probably uh, because he, he's level 17 compared to everyone else. Who's like in the late 20s. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, Flick is level 33. Yeah. Okay. Tien? Tien. No, no, no music in Tien. Tien. <clears throat> This is the town of Lac Virginite. That's not Virgin what the thing said. Virginite. Uh, to the south is the village of Premier Lamour. To the west, the township of Bière Blanche. We are the Fancy Land. These wonderful names were created for us by De General Millich Oppenheimer himself. One of the five great Imperial Generals. Help me! <laughs> I was going to say, like, that is, that is far too, like, involved with a, an introduction for somebody that usually just goes, Hi! This is such Hi, and such a place. Welcome to town. Don't mind me, lady. I'm just here to steal from you. My name is Hellion. You're McDowell, right? I know you. I myself wield power over a rune. That soul eater of yours has unlimited possibilities, but also evil intentions. I wonder what controls it. I'd like to look into your future. Okay? Not for free, of course. I'll lend you my power. Yeah. Deal? Wait. I, I, I feel like there's not a downside to this. Yeah, yeah, you're like, I'm not doing this for free. I have to join your party, and you have to give me a, a place to stay. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's what she is, I guess. She's just a bum looking room, for a shelter. Room and board. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Let's go to your castle. Mine is the power of re recall. Hello. Do I, do I hear, like, a uh, quick movement there? Like, hey. If you use this mirror, blinking mirror that's ah, in here, you can always return to your home base. That's pretty good. That's very good. All right, thank you, Hellion. Wow, that's like surprisingly easy to miss, considering how like, well, I guess it's not that easy to miss, but like, just the fact that it's optional at all. Yeah, it, it seems like a bad thing, doesn't it? Can we change the that crappy ornament? For, let's give the blinking mirror to McDoll because like he's else it gets lost forever in storage. Yeah, I I really need to like sort all of this out because it's just a mess. No, we don't need to. Thank you. Uh, we don't need items either. Mm. We're doing okay. Is this the way in? Interesting tomb. Yeah, I guess so. Hello. Ooh, blacksmith. Who 
the hell are you? Liberation Army? Never heard of you. I've no interest in such things. All I'm interested in are boats. I'll take on any job as long as it's worthy of my skills. Uh, Which. Yes, now my food is here. Sorry. No, no, it's fine. Yeah. No, I'd like to see that. Um, right, so we. Um, we met this guy. I, I think he will join us once we have a reason for him to, yeah, to do okay. so. Yeah. Because at the moment, like, obviously, we're, we're not in the we're not in the business for getting a boat. No oh, visitors during experiments. Yeah. The alchemist Commandal. I wonder if he's the guy who who will have that lab that we had set up. Oh yeah. Huh. I hate that name, Black Virginite. I wish they'd change it back to Tien. He is this an NPC or is this one of our guys? Ooh. I'm an oh, EK. Okay. I'm a martial arts master. I have respect for only for the strong. Are you strong? <laughs> no. Oh, at least you you're about eleven levels short. That's 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 pretty courteous uh, yeah. compared to what's your face, who's just like, nah, you suck. See you later. So, do we need? Do we need to board the boat? I don't think we did. We're boarding the boat. Yeah. I mean, we can't. We can't have like Are you random in battles. Right now or is it? Is it? Uh, no, I'm in oh, full control because. Um, oh, okay. Wow. So you just stole this boat. <laughs> I, I just stole this boat. What's this? Oh. Did we come across it? it? Hello, pirates. Wow, there's so little fanfare that we got with uh, getting a boat. Yeah, I guess. Who the hell are you? Liberation Army? Never heard of you. Beat it. Hi there. Oh. Dude. We run things around here. Sure you do. I mean, there's only three of you. This shack. This is the most feared shack on this island. (laughs) It's the only shack on this island, dude. Uncontested power. <laughs> um, can, can you do a quick check of the, the guide, please? Yeah, I will. I feel like we're doing the wrong thing in the wrong order. You're the Liberation Army, right? I knew it. You gotta do something about this town. South in Rickon. I remember Premier Lamour. I, I mean Premier Lamour. There used to be a famous pharmacist named Lucia. They say no, there's no medicine that he can't create. Okay, so uh, what we want to do is go south of uh, Tan to Recon. Okay. All right. Well, we'll sharpen our weapons first. That's worthwhile. And then uh, we, we want to go to the store and get some blue paint. Then we're going to want to come back here. Wait, and then what? Get on the boat. That's what? What? That's what the guide says. <laughs> okay. We're going to get some blue paint. Oh, we, yeah. I mean, there's no light, you know, Essential. department store around here, so. <laughs> blue paint. Okay, sure. Oh, I think he uses darts, huh? Yeah. Also, we're not going to be able to afford to get them up to level. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Level. Uh, it's fine. Uh, money, money generates pretty quick. Yeah. So, okay. I mean, the game didn't really. Did it tell us which way to go? I don't think it did a really good job of doing uh, that. The really. game didn't, uh, but I guess we're just supposed to kind of like look around. Yeah. Okay, we're in Rickon. Uh, uh, yeah, I want to say it's in one of these stores that you can get some some blue paint. I'm gonna assume it's this one. It's got a symbol yeah. I've never seen before. Ooh, Marner Jabba. Ooh, Laka Kikina. <laughs> I am expert appraiser. Show me your ornaments, and I will be able to fit them into boxes. 
I warn you, Jabba. Join us or die. <laughs> I I had that on VHS. I watched it so so many times. Oh yeah, yeah. My my next door neighbor did as a kid. Uh, as a kid, I didn't really get it uh, until Episode One came out. And my to my eternal shame. Uh, but uh, after after I watched Episode One and you know kind of got into it through there, uh, I am. A, a pretty big Star Wars fan these days. Yeah, uh, so I've got to say that I'm not a fan of the the current uh, yeah, Star yeah, Wars yeah. universe. I'm I'm part of the the old fashioned Star Wars universe, like fandom. Expanded um, universe. Yeah, I mean I don't yeah, get me wrong. I, I I like Disney stuff, but. I know that a lot of people don't, and they think that they're the devil worshiping uh, company. But and I, I think like their while, stuff. while all of that is true, uh, those Marvel movies, though, right? <laughs> hey, come on! I mean, <laughs> I I'm wearing I'm wearing my X Men uh, hoodie right here. Like, make 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 a Marvel universe movie of the X Men, please. please. Stop giving it to please Sony. Please. Stop giving it to uh, Sony and Fox. They don't know what to do with it. You know, they're 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 not. Good. And I think no. I think more recently, I think more recently they got they got the rights back, right? Yes. Just by dint of buying the people who owned the rights. <laughs> Pretty much. I, it does make you wonder, like, how much of that is down to the fact that, like, oh my god, they're making an absolute me- mess of this. We need to get it back. It, right. it will cost us four hundred million dollars to just buy them. Okay, yes, Whatever. just buy them. Just buy them. Four hundred million. <sighs> yeah, we'll make that back in a week. Yeah. We'll make that back just when our stock goes up from the announcement that we bought Fox. Now that you mention it, that's probably true, isn't it? Yeah, how about that? It yeah. Seems like it might maybe a little bit of a broken system. Hmm. Maybe, yeah. maybe a slight yeah, monopoly though. Do not think about that ever. Oh yeah, yeah. We traveled a long way after hearing that a renowned pharmacist lived here. I was hoping he'd have a cure for my sick child, but my child is dead. Wait, Turns what? out he's not a very good pharmacist. I guess. Like, I don't know where he Here's is. Here's my pharmacy but... slash restaurant. Oh, Aha. maybe that's him. Oh. Have you seen my cat anywhere? Nope. Damn it, now we have to go find a cat. Now we have to go find a cat. I, I, I don't think we ever took what's her face as uncle to her. No, we didn't. Uh, we didn't. We need to go back. But I mean, it, it it's a boat ride away. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not that really. We're going to be saying that all game. We'd be like, yeah, we can get her whenever we want, and then we just never get around to it. Wait, so have we gone to all of the stores? Yeah, like I think so. Have we looked at their their menus? You know what? No, we didn't look at the menu for the uh, the item <laughs> store here. I just assumed that it would be like a you know a, a, a unique r- place. Blue paint material Seriously? for a mural. Seriously, that that's what we need. Yeah. Okay. I. So wait, we can't actually do anything till we get this blue paint. Uh. I, I guess. Uh. Wait. It did say get on the boat. I don't know if it meant for us to get on the boat in recon or if it meant for us to get on the boat in. Uh, um. Let's see What's here. So. Uh. Let's see. Uh, yeah, now go to the docks, board the boat, and head out to for sea. Uh, this, uh, this ride is not good. Uh, North or south? Uh, s- south. <laughs> of course, the, w- the other way that I'm not going. Uh, there should be a, a whirlpool at some point, and that will be how we know we're going in the correct direction. Okay, is that what the blue paint is for? We're gonna, like, just tip, like, violent, like, you know, waste into the sea? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna win through uh, polluting the water supply of our enemy. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just the to show where we've been. The old, the old I, I I feel like I've gone the wrong way. It might feel that way. Oh, okay. There it is. Wow. Yeah, that's just a long trip. Rapids. Rapids. Okay. So now you're gonna hate this. Oh, go go on. But, uh, 
They lead to a whirlpool that you cannot pass. Now return to Recon and head <laughs> to Tayen. Speak to Gen, the shipbuilder, about your predicament. Oh no. Oh, I would. How is anyone supposed to know this? Like, how's somebody supposed to figure this out? I guess you're just supposed to. You're just supposed to explore and stuff. They're, they're, they're like, yeah, just go. Uh, can you imagine Bar Barbosa and uh, Lady Windy are just there, like tapping their feet, like Sonic the Hedgehog, just going, "Who? Oh, where are they?" You know, they've just been stuck it's in the rapids for. Like, yeah, we, we should be doing mortal battle with them, with them right now. Where are they? They they took a long turn at the fork in the in the rapids, and they've been stuck at sea ever since. Ugh. Yeah. Um. One one of the other things I've been doing where, with my time off is is watching a little show called Ted Lasso. Do you know of this? I, I went the wrong way. I went. I the think wrong you're way. supposed to go back to Recon and then we go north to uh, Tan on land. Okay. So here's here's Recon. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I completely messed up. Oh, okay. This I'm not in control. Oh, here we go. Oh, what shall we do? We can't go any farther. Oh, we can't do this with an ordinary boat. If only we knew somebody who could build a boat. But yeah, yeah, I guess it's, uh, it leaves the player to say that for themselves. Yeah. Rather than, um, like, hand board you all the way back up to, to town. Are yeah, you Ted Lasso on the, on the main map? It does look that way, doesn't it? Ted Lasso, yeah. have you ever heard of it? No, I haven't. It is a show on the Apple TV network. Oh. And it, it stars um, Jason, is it Sedelkis or something like that? Oh, I think so. I, I think I know who you're talking about. Uh, yeah. What, what was he in? He was in, uh, uh, he was in Deadpool 2. No, Deadpool. <clears throat> and Deadpool 2. Um, and he he is a, uh, an American football coach who is hired... Uh, to coach a football team in the UK. Oh. <laughs> so he's a fish. He's a fish out of water. Like uh, doesn't know any of the terms. Like doesn't know the offside rule. Anything like that. Um, but is maybe one of the most wholesome shows I've ever seen. Like oh, everyone. Cool. I. He, so he's one. He's a chatterbox sort of guy. He's always like you know. Hey, come on in. Everything's fine. I'm going I'm, I'm having a great day. Everything's fantastic. Life is great. You have any problems? Then my problems. I'll help you out. Anything that you need, and and he gets like this sort of atmosphere going where everyone is like really emotionally like open with each other, and it's mm -hmm. just it's really odd because like football, I don't know what American football is like, but in the UK, football is like this this horrible like it's like the online community. Everybody is just like doggy oh, yeah. dog. Everything is yeah. like you know up for debate. Everyone's wrong. You, I, I'm always right. You're always wrong. Everyone hates each other. It's just like that, yeah. and it's it's really awful. And they introduce this character who's like this really is emotionally, is he's so emotionally happy. Blind region based hatred. Yeah, he, he's like, we're not having any of that. Like you know, I, he and he's it's so nice. It's so nice, yeah. and I really like it. Like it's good. the the humor is occasionally is belittling, but it's very sort of like sort of like. Mm, in the, in the tamest way possible, like you mm -hmm. know, it, when it happens, it's sort of like uh, I hate the word banter, but there's there's sort of like a little bit of banter, mm -hmm. but for the most part, the humor comes from like misunderstandings, but oh, like yeah, yeah. because of cultural things, and people are like, oh, I'm sorry, did I make a mistake there? Did did I say the wrong thing? And everyone's just like, no, it's okay, don't worry about it. This is a safe space, you know. It it's yeah. so odd. It shouldn't really work, but it it really does. It's fantastic. Uh, it's called Ted Lasso. Ted Lasso. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll look into yeah. that. It's fun. <clears throat> you guys again? What do you want? <laughs> Why would we come into this person's house and say we have no business yeah, with you? No business with you. And then you just stand there for 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> we need a boat that can beat the rapids. The rapids are done, Annie. Hmm, interesting. All right, I again will show you what I can do, but I can't do this alone. An ordinary boat will never make it. I need some blue paint. Please don't say you need some blue paint. I need a blue boat. <laughs> what will you do? 
I have some ideas. Old Camendol next door should be able to help us. Even if he's half dead, let's go see him. Again, we'll join the party. Reduce party membership by one. So that's all, all we right. needed to, uh, to convince him. Um, okay. <coughs> here we go. Look at this sign here. The old geezer thinks he's a big shot. Hey, old man, I know you're in there. Come out, you bummer. I'll break down the door. You were good. I told you not to disturb my experiments. Here you are, you creepy old man. You should get some sunlight. You look sick. Come on out. I warned you not to call me old man. What do you want with me, anyway? Bringing these delinquents with you. De de delinquents? Don't you dare insult young master. I can understand such language for Victor. Fair. Whoa, 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 wait a minute, don't confuse the issue. Hey, geezer, do you know the Dunnan Rapids? I was going to ask you how you can be navigated. But come to think of it, a senile old fool wouldn't, like you wouldn't have a clue, right? Watch your mouth. I can do anything, depending <clears throat> on time and the money. So there is a way. Of course. Oh, sure. Step inside. Nice, we tricked him. Dude, this is the furnace. Like what? This is my furnace. Look at this. This will hit you over the rapids. Wait, it's an engine, isn't it? It's, it a, it's is. an enormous engine, but it is an engine. What is it? It's a machine that moves by burning oil. A machine that runs on oil? Sounds ridiculous. So if you attach this to a boat, you can travel upstream? Correct. Okay then, let's take this to... Uh, Plummy Lamar, Prummy Lam, Pram Yam Lobby. Premier Lamar, you idiot. Shut up. You can remember a stupid name like that. Let's go to Recon. Take good care of this machine. It's fragile. And, and also, also, I'm giving it to you for free. Yeah, and weighs about uh, 500 pounds. Uh, what? You mean... We have to carry it? Of course. We plan on letting a frail old man carry this. Come and tell me, join. What party? <laughs> okay. Hmm, I wonder who we should remove. Alright, bye guys! <clears throat> We just, All yeah. right, in the pocket. Great. I I hope we have like back insurance, like health insurance for our <laughs> back, because it's going to be ruined by the the time we get there. Okay. Weird. Yeah. Oh. Holly fairies that are floating without any reasonable means of looking like they should. Yeah. Float. We just levitate. Like these wings, they're just they're. They're decorative. Yeah. Our, our two new guys have a Unite attack, by the way. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we haven't seen too many of those yet. Not yet. Ha! <laughs> <Hey. laughs> you just chopped him up. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> He's just screaming. you are like, everyone else is like, whoa, hold on. We just... Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't prepared for that. Not from two He's science like... types. We just like bloodless, bloodlessly stab our enemies. Well, again. Oh man, that's that's gruesome. That's, that's horrific. Okay, I mean it works well. All in the name of science. So 
excellent. We have like so many short range characters now. Oh yeah. So, uh, I'm surprised that uh, Common Ball is. Uh, yeah, short range uh, character. That's uh, odd, isn't it? Yeah, it's rough. It's weird how you know they are forcing us to use this party. Yeah. And no matter what, somebody is going to be useless. Mm hmm Here we are. Go ahead and unload the equipment. Oh, thank God I can bid this load for a while. Farewell. It was a pretty tough fighting with this on my back. <laughs> hey, geezer, let's get to work. I don't have to be reminded by you. But doll, you're all getting in the way, so why don't you go to the inn or something? Don't worry, you'll have a shiny vessel in no time. Why did we need the paint? I'm still not sure. <laughs> okay. Damn that old man, making me carry such a heavy load. Ooh, I'm exhausted. Let's call it an early night. I actually think this is a good point to stop as well. So um, let's uh, let's stop with our uh, like Dragon Ball Z Z's. Yeah, uh, oh, yeah. we'll call it that. <laughs> yeah. So all right, uh, we did a couple of battles. We we made some progress in the story, and we got some blue paint for some in it. One day, hey, it, it, maybe we'll need it later. I, maybe we need it for specific recruitment. I don't know. Maybe. But hey, there you go. Anyway, no uh, that's going to do it for today. So uh, thank you for joining me as usual, Austin. And no uh, thank, thank you, you everyone for watching. And we'll see you again next time. Ciao. Goodbye. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> Do the little toad. <laughs> <laughs>